computer science videos here today to show you guys in this tutorial how to change the view of your presentation on the keynote application using a Mac computer without further ado let us start the video so in this tutorial you need to have access to a Mac computer have access to the keynote application which is built into the Mac computer we can now start the tutorial before I start this tutorial, I would like to say that you are more than welcome to subscribe to my channel, Computer Science Videos. As we know, every problem is solved by indirection. You can also follow my Twitter account. We are trying to grow as fast as ever. I'm on TikTok. We post videos here and there. Follow my page on Facebook. I'm also on Instagram. You are more than welcome to support me on PayPal. Let's now focus on the video. So now let's go over to the dock, go to Launchpad, go to the Keynote application, search for the Keynote application, enter to open up the application, wait for that to load. Once it is loaded, go to the top toolbar, go to File, go to Open. This will take us directly to the desktop where we have presentation.key. Click on this, now go to Open, wait for that to load. So let's now increase the size of the presentation window. So we have our presentation on screen and we wish to change the view on screen. Let's go to the top toolbar where it says view. Let's change back to navigator. Let's now change to slide only. So everything on the side has disappeared. Go back to view, light table. Everything is tabilized. Outline. Edit master slides if we wish to. Click on done, go back to view, show, find and replace. If we need to search for a word, click on this and then replace with another word. That's how that works. Show rulers, there we have the rulers on top. Hide comments, they're all gone. Show presenter notes if we have any. So we can now type some notes if we need that for our own reference. Let's go back to Navigator. If we now navigate back to the view mode, we can hide presenter notes. And there we go. Command us to save, quit keynote. And so that's for this video. I'll see you guys in my next tutorial. Thanks for now. Thank you for making it towards the end of the video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel, Computer Science Videos. Be sure to check out the previous video on screen now, or you can ideally click on the playlist and watch all the journey for Computer Science Videos from the start until now.